At this point, you should have completed the assembly of the upper receiver components, installed the barrel, the gas tube, the bolt carrier group, the charging handle, the front sight base, and the flash hider. For this set of instructions, we're using the Brownells Lower Receiver Parts Kit. The Lower Receiver Parts Kit is a fast, easy way to get all the parts you need by ordering only one stock number. We will demonstrate the installation of the lower receiver components and most aftermarket components installed in the same way. If you're not using military configured parts, be sure you read and fully understand the instructions provided by the manufacturer. We will follow a specific order of assembly so that we don't run into problems of parts interfering with each other. We will install the magazine catch first, then the bolt catch, the pivot pin, then the trigger group, followed by the safety selector and the pistol grip, and then finally install the trigger guard. The tools that you will need are the lower receiver vice block, a large tip flathead screwdriver, bolt catch pin punch, a number three and four roll pin holders and punches, a four ounce ball peen hammer, your bench vise and a gun mat. You may find it helpful to have the Brownells pivot pin installation tool. It prevents the pivot pin spring and detent from launching out of your receiver while trying to install the pivot pin.